Hey there YouTube, Alana here from teachtraffic.com and in today's video we're going to be talking all about the keyword match type updates that Google has recently announced at the time of this recording in early February uh, to their uh, search campaign. So if you're running a Google ad campaign on the search network then you really need to pay attention to this because like this industry goes change is the only constant and this update is going to have quite a big impact if you're running search campaigns. So let's get stuck in. Essentially hopefully you are aware that when you are running search campaigns that a match type criteria applies to the keywords that you're targeting. Okay, so you've got exact match type, phrase match, modified broad, and standard broad match type keywords. If you, if you have a look at this table here, this is a table provided by Google actually, which outlines the difference between the match types of their keywords. Probably not news to you if you're watching this video, uh, you're probably aware of the different match types. No surprise there. What has been up announced and updated as of uh, the announcement came out on February 4th of 2021 and this announcement will apply uh, towards the end of February is that phrase match is no longer phrase match. Phrase match is going to be blended into modified broad match. So if you have got campaigns that are running at modified broad match, then um, effectively they're basically called phrase match now and your phrase match uh, match type keywords are essentially modified broad match. So it's really important for the people who are running phrase match type keywords with the inverted commas that you really start to have to pay attention to your search term reports now because your search terms or your ads are going to be showing up for probably lots of irrelevant terms that you possibly don't want. So this is a pretty big impact for people who rely on phrase match to really hone in um, for, on what terms they want to show for. So you definitely want to pay attention to this. Uh, we do have an article on our blog at teachtraffic.com. I'll put a link in the description to a further explanation about this. But be aware that this is an update that has been announced and they really haven't give, uh, given advertisers very long to prepare since the announcements. They said that this was going to be rolled out in two weeks. Uh, so really that's towards the end of February and um, you have to be aware that this now applies. There's a, a help article by Google which kind of explains the difference of before this rollout and after this rollout and really this is just part of Google's constant changes of uh, effectively taking that level of control away from advertisers um, and just you know giving Google more control. This was one of the updates um, one of the updates I did in 2020 was that exact match was pretty much no longer exact match. I like to call it exact-ish match <laughs> where you know you might think that you're bidding on an exact term and suddenly your uh, that keyword is showing up for lots of uh, somewhat you know close variants they, they call it. So you really you know never has it been more important to have a look through your search term report to really um, identify you know what your ad is showing for to make sure that it's um, on target and it's exactly what you want and then adding those negatives and another announcement that Google uh, released in September of 2020 was that they are removing all the search terms so that you only get a compressed um, table or list of the search terms so it's something that you really have to kind of do every day. We have um, scripts that run that automate our search term reports so we can download them and have a look through them to make sure that we're constantly adding negatives uh, into our account to keep our click-through rate high and keep our conversion rate high so, we're showing, so that we're constantly showing up for the right terms. Okay so be aware phrase match is no longer phrase match it is now the modified broad match which sounds weird and um, yeah stay tuned for future updates be, be sure to subscribe to the teach traffic channel hit the like button if you've enjoyed this video and this update and we'll catch you on the next video